Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will do some lip swatches of the Ultra Last Lipsticks by Essence. I will also do a wear test for one of the colors and we will see together if these are actually Ultra Last. As always, don't forget to subscribe to get notified for my latest videos and without further ado, Let's get started with the lip swatches. On my face right now I have some products by Essence as well and I have already posted the reviews of these products. For the face makeup it is another video and for the eye makeup another one. I will link all the videos in the description box below. On my lips right now I have Shine 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 Lip Gloss by Essence and this is the Happiness in a Bottle and I always wear this one when I am starting my videos and I look like a ghost so I will take it off and I will start with the ultra last lipsticks so the first color that I'm going to use it is number seven and it is called Andres my lips this is like a movish natural color and let's see how it looks on the lips okay I like this color this is very nice for every day so this looks very natural on the lips, it is like a mauveish caramel color, it's not completely mauveish, it is not glossy but not matte also and it is very comfortable on the lips. So the next color that I'm going to use is number 16 and it is called Fancy Blush. So this one looks on the tube like a mauveish uh, darker color, let's see how it applies on the lips. Okay, it is darker. Yeah, I was right. If you go a little bit overboard with your lipstick, you can very easily clean the edges with a Q-tip. It doesn't stain the skin. This is a berry color, a more subtle one. It is like a dark berry, but not a vibrant one. This is very nice also for every day. And it looks very nice on the lips. And if you want to make it even less intense, you can just take the color with your fingers and dab a little bit of product on your lips and also apply on top of it some lip balm and it will be very sheer. This formula doesn't intensify the lines of the lips and it looks very healthy. Moving on to the next color, I will use number 10 and this is the color pink candy. I have already used this one in my Valentine pink glam makeup tutorial. I will link it down below. This is like a vibrant pink purple color. This color is very romantic. I like it. This will look amazing on darker skin tones as well. Oh my god, this looks so beautiful. I forgot this color, how it looks on my lips. Very cute. This one stained my lips a little bit. I think we will be okay because the next one is a red color. So the next color that I'm going to use is number 12 and it is called Head to Head Tomatoes. <laughs> what a name! This is this is a tomato color, yeah. Let's see how this applies on the lips. It is a very vibrant red. So this is how Head Tomatoes looks on my lips and it is the only one that the color is not completely opaque. It is a little bit patchy but not a lot. I also like that it makes my teeth whiter and brighter. That's always a thumbs up and it is a little bit patchy. For example, when I press my lips, I can see the line that the color is separated, but it's not a lot and you can fix that with a red lip pencil all over your lips like a base and then on top of it apply the lipstick. Always if you use a lip pencil as a base, it will make your lipsticks last longer. The formula is very comfortable on the lips for all the colors and it is very easy to apply the product product on the lips. So I applied again Fussy Blush and I will keep this one for the rest of the day and we will see if it is also long lasting. If you prefer a more matte finish for your lipsticks, I will link down below the lip swatches that I have done for the matte 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 lipsticks by Essence in a lot of different colors that I got. So don't go anywhere and I will see you in just one sec. Hi guys, so it's been six hours and let's see what happened with our lipstick. So as we can see the color faded in the inner part of my lips. It is not as shiny as before 
and also it is not creamy anymore. It is a little drying on the lips. It is not as comfortable as before. It's been a lot of hours. I also ate and I drank a lot of water with my straw, but again, I ate and I drank. So for me, it's a lot of hours to wear a lipstick and not reapply it or remove it and apply it again because most of the times when I eat I remove my lipstick because I don't want to eat my lipstick this time I didn't remove it and I like that it didn't bleed and it didn't came out of my lip lines I believe that with a lip pencil as a base this would look more opaque now so this one is a very nice formula for me and I hope that Essence will come out with some other more spring and summery colors. Let me know in the comments below which lip product is your favorite from the drugstore. I always like to test new products. If you found this video informative or entertaining, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye!